Good day all, Cheryl here, Nature Within. Yes, it is TGIF, thank God it is Friday, and that's why I'm wearing my red. Yes, in remembrance of our troops, R-E-D, remember everyone deployed. Yes, I uh, was busy last uh, Friday, <laughs> and uh, I'm making time today. Yes. Uh, so the healing modality I would like to talk about today is uh, saying no. Yeah, saying no. No is very healing for ourselves and for others, whether they realize it or not. Yes. Yeah. So remember that uh, honoring yourself is saying no. Uh, a lot of times, like when we were younger and whatnot, how we were brought up is there was no no. <laughs> you know, we were told by our parents. We were told, uh, you know, um, controlled, I'll say, yes. Controlled by our parents. And uh, then we were controlled by our school systems. And then we were controlled by our schools and then controlled by the, uh, the churches and uh, being controlled by the uh, government and uh, large organizations and so on. Yes, and uh, yeah. So in order to say no is you don't have to say sorry after. <laughs> That's the uh, one thing that I really uh, learned about unless you know you accidentally bumped into someone you know, then you can say sorry, right? Uh, or you accidentally drop something and whatnot, right? Mm -hmm. Or made a boo-boo or whichever, but yeah, then say sorry. But don't say sorry for changing your mind or don't say sorry for uh, feeling the way that you do. Yeah, yes, so saying no is uh, actually very honorable for yourself and the more and more that we practice this uh you know the um the easier it'll be it won't be so um uh, it won't it won't be so uh you know hard to do that's the word i guess i'm looking for <laughs> it won't you won't feel guilty you won't feel it, it won't feel hard to do yeah it, uh, it, it feels more honorable. It's not a uh, egoic thing. It is, uh, it just feels very honoring to yourself. Yeah. So when you have to say no to someone uh, because of whichever reason, uh, just say, no, I changed my mind. Excuse me. That's what I try to tell my clients. Uh, a lot of them are women. And uh, yeah, so after we say uh, no, you could say, excuse me, I've changed my mind. Or no, excuse me, it's just not resonating with me. And yes, I know that I promised to go, but, or no, I'm not going because I don't feel well. You know, it could be any of those, or I'm just not feeling that. And there could be uh, the whole room of people or the whole group of people, they're all like, you know, doing it a certain way and uh, or believe in something and you're just not feeling it and we are humans here on planet earth yes uh so follow your spiritual uh inner inner feelings and inner soul so when something is not feeling right then we must uh change our mind say no uh or no i don't agree right and even with the, um, the, uh, the um, excuse me, the, uh, the troops, excuse me, the troops right now, yes, uh, some in the United States, some in uh, Canada, some from all over, some of them are saying no. They don't agree about what different things or, or challenges or uh, differences and new, new things that they are you know, that they are inviting into the, uh, into their, um, their job titles and whatnot, what to do and what not to do. And some people are saying no, and it's not just with our troops. It is with other people too. <laughs> and it's very, very hard thing to do. 
It certainly is. Some of us lose our jobs um, because we don't agree with the company that we're working for. Or we don't agree with, uh, you know, our mayors and our counselors and our, uh, you know, MPs and our, um, the townships and whatnot. Yes. So follow your heart, it, you know, and if it uh, feels good for you, that's all that matters because this whole world really does resonate around you. We just forget that. <laughs> it's called loving ourselves. Yeah, loving ourselves is saying no. There was something else that I wanted to say about, uh, yes. Um, it is an uncomfortable thing to do at first, but the more and more you do it, you will. Like I said, you will feel more honorable. And that is for sure. Oh yeah, that's what I wanted to say. And I, I've, said, I've said this before. So say if you uh, want to do something like whatever, you're wild, like you like walking upside down <laughs> on the ceiling, or you like doing this, or you like doing that. And everyone is like, that is not the normal thing to do. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Whatever is best for you is what is best for you. We are not all the same. If we were all the same, it would be a pretty boring world, wouldn't it? Yeah, it would be quite monotonous <laughs> if we were all the same. So let us accept each other's different ways of thinking, acting, uh, what we believe in and whatnot, and just honor, you know, honor yourself and uh, keep your mind open to what is going on around you and respect people. Yes, you know, for what they want, say if you, you know, you are in the residence or you are, uh, you know, working in a certain place. Yes, we have to follow the rules. That is for sure. But if something isn't resonating with you anymore and you need a change, it's okay. It's okay to say no. Thank that person, you know, uh, address them and let them know that you uh, believe in, uh, you know, whatever, whatever for reason why you're saying no or when or why you you are leaving or parting ways. And I wanted to say thank you very much for all of our troops. Yeah, especially the ones that are standing up. A lot of people and they are losing money. They are losing money, they are losing their reputation. Uh, you know, with these major groups, associations and whatnot, but uh, we all do love you and love yourself please yes in honoring yourself yeah so enjoy your friday tgif yes and always keep nature within thank you for being here blessings to you and